Well, time now for a look at what else happened in politics today. The Prime Minister and Conservative Party leader joined members of the Jewish community this morning, speaking at a ceremony in Ottawa to mark Yom HaShoah, also known as Holocaust Remembrance Day. Yom HaShoah is an Israeli holiday observed by Jews around the world, and it commemorates the more than six million Jews killed in the Holocaust during the Second World War at the hands of the Nazis. In their remarks, Justin Trudeau and Pierre Polyev condemned the rise in anti-Semitic incidents in Canada, especially in the aftermath of the October 7 attack. That's why combating anti-Semitism requires hard work every day. And this work cannot be a problem for the Jewish community to solve alone. It is not a problem for Deborah or Jewish organizations to solve alone. It is not a problem for governments to solve alone though we will and must continue to do everything we can, it is up to everyone to take on this challenge, all Canadians together. I know that some of you are making the heart-wrenching decision. Do I walk outside with the Star of David on my chest? Do I wear my kippah? Do I keep my masuza on the door? You worry about the safety of your loved ones in Canada. It is absolutely unacceptable that you should be faced with this dilemma. You must be allowed to live fearlessly and proudly Jewish lives, and it is the responsibility of every Canadian, Jewish or otherwise, to stand with your right to do that. The result of the aggressive rise in anti-Semitism is that Jews from coast to coast, after being subjected to dehumanizing levels of hate over the course of the previous year, have been left feeling ostracized and abandoned. The systemic nature of the anti-Semitism has forced Canadian Jews to question the continued vitality of the nation's Jewish communities. Well, that was B'nai B'rith Canada, and today on this Monday, they released their annual anti-Semitism audit. The report found a dramatic increase in anti-Semitic incidents year over year. There were more than 5,700 reported incidents of anti-Semitism in 2023, the highest on record according to the report. That figure includes a number of violent attacks and reports of harassment against the Jewish community. B'nai B'rith representatives were joined by a group of MPs on the Hill this morning, raising awareness and calling on the government to do more to protect the Jewish community from hate. 5,791 anti-Semitic incidents up in just one year. That's nearly five-fold in 10 years. I don't know how to say this any other way, but it is a crisis in Canada. It is rampant in our streets, on our university campuses, and everywhere in between, in workplaces, online. It's like forest fire that is running rampant across the country. Uh, Anti-Semitism is everywhere. It is in the workplace, it is in our communities, it is in our neighborhoods, uh, it is in our places of worship. Uh, Certainly in in my community, I've uh, spoken with families uh, virtually every day uh, since October the 7th. And it is horrifying to hear uh, the stories that they tell me. Uh, They're afraid to keep their mezuzahs on their door. They're afraid to send their children to school. Uh, They're afraid uh, to display uh, any aspect of their Jewish identity. And this is a gross, uh, a gross injustice.